What's happening everyone? My name is Alex and welcome back. For this camera comparison we have the latest and greatest from Google, the Pixel 4. We also have the latest and greatest from Apple, the iPhone 11, but unfortunately we only have the Huawei P30 Pro. So we don't have the latest and greatest, the Mate 30 Pro. So I guess um, we'll have to do with these ones. So throughout this video we are going to check out a bunch of pictures that I took during the day. Of course I've included some um, portrait mode pictures as well. There are also a bunch of nighttime pictures and for the nighttime pictures I did use the night modes on these three devices. After those we are going to check out some daytime sample videos, then some nighttime sample videos and of course at the end some selfies. And just in case you are wondering, all the pictures were taken about a second apart from each other and um, on auto mode. And all three devices are running the latest um, software update available today. And today is November 6, 2019. And with that being said, I think we should start by checking out some daytime pictures. Alright, so the first thing I've noticed about the daytime pictures is the fact that the pictures taken by the iPhone 11 and the Pixel 4 look almost identical. So we get the same colors, we get the same dynamic range, we get the same sharpness, so there is almost no difference. And I have to say that the pictures taken by the iPhone 11 and the Pixel 4 look closer to reality than the pictures taken by the P30 Pro. So the P30 Pro doesn't seem to do as good as the other two. The colors are more saturated and the pictures don't seem to be as consistent as the pictures that we get from the iPhone 11 and the Pixel 4. And yes, I know, the um, Huawei P30 Pro is also older than the other two, two devices. So in my opinion, the Pixel 4 and the iPhone 11 do very similar for daytime pictures and definitely better than um, the P30 Pro. But um, of course, let me know your thoughts and let me know which device you think does better for um, daytime pictures. Alright, so moving on to portrait mode pictures. Well, here the Pixel 4 has the most details, but I personally prefer the brighter looking pictures from the iPhone 11. They are just more eye-pleasing in my opinion. So once again, the P30 Pro seems to be the last one um, for portrait mode pictures. And uh, I have a few more pictures that um, I, want, uh, I want you to see and I will be right back. Alright, and we are moving on to nighttime pictures. As I mentioned earlier, all the nighttime pictures are taken using the night mode on all three devices. So the first thing I've noticed is the fact that most pictures taken by the Huawei P30 Pro have a somewhat green looking tint. And the pictures don't seem to look as pleasing as the other ones. For picture sharpness, I feel that the iPhone 11 does the best out of the three, but the Pixel 4 has the somewhat brighter pictures. So if I would have to choose the nighttime pictures that I prefer the most, I think I would choose most pictures taken by the Pixel 4. But definitely let me know what you guys think, which phone do you think does best for um, nighttime pictures? And we are moving on to some video recordings. Well, for video recordings, I done um, 4K at 30 frames per second with all three devices. So for video quality, I feel that the iPhone 11 does the best. Um, the iPhone 11 seems to do the best for um, image stabilization as well, followed very close by the Pixel 4 and with the P30 Pro being the last one for colors um, and um, image stabilization. Now for the microphone recordings, so the recordings um, that we do with the microphones in these devices, I feel that the P30 Pro does the best, followed by the Pixel 4 and then followed by the iPhone 11. 
As for nighttime videos, well, for nighttime videos, the P30 Pro has the brightest videos, followed by the Pixel 4, but then for um, video sharpness, I feel that the iPhone 11 does better than the other two, even though those videos look much darker. So definitely let me know in the comments down below which phone you prefer for um, video recordings. So let's check out those samples and I'll be right back. All right, we have a quick video test between the iPhone 11, the Huawei P30 Pro and the, the Pixel 4. So I'm currently recording in 4K, 30 frames per second, and at this resolution we have um, image stabilization for um, all three devices. As you can probably see, I am um, walking slowly and it is also a bit windy, but definitely not, uh, not bad. So this is how recording from these three devices would look like if you're walking and recording in 4K at 30 frames per second. And we're moving on to our next video test between the Pixel 4, the Huawei P30 Pro and of course some of the iPhone 11. Once again, I'm recording in 4K at 30 frames per second where we have a new stabilization for um, all three devices and it's also a bit windy and as you can probably see I am walking a bit um, faster so you can see which device does better um, with the EMI stabilization. I'm actually gonna run for a few steps here once again to see which one does uh, better. So I'm gonna stop here, pull pan left and back right. So this is how recording from these three devices would look like. Alright, so we are moving on to another quick video test, but this time around in low light because as you can probably see, it's um, it's nighttime. So I'm currently recording in 4K, 30 frames per second um, with the Pixel 4, the um, iPhone 11 and of course the Huawei P30 Pro. So I'm gonna walk past the church here because um, it gets darker um, around there. So you can see which device does better um, in darkness because that's um, what's important. It is also a bit windy and you're probably gonna hear some traffic to my left. So I'm almost here. Well, it's not as dark as I thought, but uh, still, we can have an idea how these three devices do in, uh, in the dark, basically. And we are moving on to our second and last uh, video test between the Pixel 4, the Huawei P30 Pro and the iPhone 11 in low light. Once again, I'm recording in 4K, 30 frames per second. And as you can probably see, I am walking and you shouldn't hear any other noise aside from my voice. Well, maybe a bit of traffic uh, to my right. So I'm going to pan right and left. So this is how recording from these three devices would look like in low light. And we are moving on to selfies, just in case you wanted to see more selfies of myself. So for selfies, I feel that um, the iPhone 11 and the Pixel 4 do the best for daytime selfies. And in some of those pictures, I think I actually prefer the Pixel 4 in some the iPhone 11, with the P30 Pro being the last one for daytime selfies. As for nighttime selfies, um, it looks like the Pixel 4 does better for every single one. So yeah, for selfies for daytime, I think the iPhone 11 and the Pixel 4, but for nighttime selfies, I think the Pixel 4 um, does the best. So to quickly conclude this video, I feel that the iPhone 11 and the Pixel 4 are very, very close for daytime and nighttime pictures, almost no difference for that. But for video recordings, I feel that the iPhone 11 does better than the Pixel. With the P30 Pro unfortunately being one of the last uh, last ones. So if this video would have been done last year, well, the P30 Pro would have been fast, uh, the first one um, last year. But um, a lot changes in, um, in one year. So definitely let me know in the comments down below if you prefer the iPhone, the Pixel or the P30 Pro. Alright guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did like it, don't forget to press that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.